Hello there guys and welcome back to a, another video on this channel. My name is Andy Crobicide and today this is just my mic. I should really do this before I start recording. But yeah, sometimes you just forget to do things. Right, so today we're playing a bit of Injustice 2. I love this game. So uh, we're going to be doing a little bit of Endless in the uh, multiverse section of um, the game. And uh, we are going to be taking the Green Lantern into the multiverse to do this Endless. So what Endless is, is we fight an extremely large amount of opponent. We basically fight until we lose. So we don't know how long this video is going to be. It could be a while. It could be a while. Um, but I plan to do a endless uh, multiverse endless on every character in Injustice 2, um, as long uh, as well as like other stuff like um, multiplayer, online gameplays, and all that kind of thing. I, I want to do as much as I can. So it looks like our first fight is the uh, Black Canary. I hope, I hope I don't lose the first fight. Otherwise, it's going to be a very short video. But um, I don't. I don't think I'll be losing the good fight. And as um, as as you've noticed, I mentioned in the, fight, the first video I done, I need some new headphones. I do have new headphones now. Ha! Eat leg. Eat punch. Ow! Get wrecked. Well, that failed. That one didn't know. Haha. <laughs> Get wrecked. Just. Yeah, get screwed. So, yeah. Um, as you can tell at the moment, I'm button mashing. I want to get better with the Green Lantern, but. Um, yeah, I mean, Green Lantern is my highest level character at the moment, so. Oh, I thought she missed that then. Yeah, I guess true. So, yeah, for some, anyone that is wondering, yes, I'm playing the Green Lantern, but on top of that, I am um, wearing a shader. Because you can customize characters now in um, this uh, universe. Well, goodbye. Sweet travels. No, leave me alone. Get right. So I have got my little recording buddy as well. So if you hear a cat meow or anything, that is why. He's taking up room on my bed at the moment. So we got Superman for our next fight. So a lot of people have been saying, I mean I've played both Injustice games, I mean personally I can't really tell the difference, but there's a lot of people saying that Superman is considerably more powerful in this one than he is in the first. Um, I mean, me personally, I can't really say I can see any difference between this soups and old soups. Oh, I was going to go for a transition. I think that's the way you transition on this um, map. I'm not sure. I love how um, what do we call it? The uh, the some some of the jokes in this game are just hilarious. Okay, so the transition is on the other side of the map. I'm the man of steel. Ring, don't fail me now. <laughs> okay, so yeah, he got some health back off of that. Oh, 
That hurts. Dig punch. Dig punch for the win, people. Dig punch for the win. So yeah, it's because of my um, shader. Oh, gear. Yeah. Okay. So yeah, it's because of my shader that the green lantern is actually now purple lantern. Basically. And a lot of people might be wondering where I got that shield from. That is actually an ability, because you can actually get customized abilities for characters in this game now. Which is something you couldn't do in the first. So, um, I'll just pop it now. There you go. Um, so, what, what that is, is basically it's uh, a shield. Um, it absorbs a little bit of energy, but or a little bit of power, I should say, but not. But I wouldn't say it absorbs enough um, to be relevant. But that might just be down to my level and gear. Yeah, transition. Wow. I love the transitions in this game, but sometimes they just confuse me. Those low kicks, man. Those low kicks. not going to spend anything. Because it was obvious that he was going to use all um, all three and I am going to need mine for uh, meter burn moves such as that to try and keep this down so he doesn't actually take a life bar off me. I feel like I took that straight from the Hulk and the Avengers. hook of death. The right hook of the lantern core. So yeah, like I say, the green lantern is my highest level um, character. That is why I have... Um, I'm doing the green lantern first. That's basically the reason why. Because he's my highest level character. And I will be doing a massive um, mother box opening video at some point as well. Has authority here. And if I protest, authority will be enforced. Begin. Get wrecked! This is actually kind of painful because I love the green arrow as well. So the other reason I um, do this is because um, it's a good way to farm out gear. Oh, oh we. The fight never stops when you um, play this game, I swear. You go from like a level transition and you'll go straight into... Um... Oh, as if the boxing glove arrow. Get back! So, uh, something I'm kind of glad they put in is the boxing glove arrow, because they didn't have it in the first, so I'm kind of glad they put it in this time. At least I don't think they had it in the first. They might have done. I just can't remember right, or I'm remembering wrong, or something like that. They might have. They might well have had it. I'm not sure. 
But yeah, I've been spending a lot of time in the multiverse um, farming up mother boxes. So, um, yeah, I will do a mother box opening video where it's literally a video of nothing but mother boxes. Overcoming fear is kind of my thing. Begin. Oh, Brainiac. Seriously? Sit. Sit. That was some tentacle porn shit right there. Leave me alone. He have officially made me feel uncomfortable playing Injustice 2. How do you? Oh, I keep getting the combo wrong. I'm hoping we get a new Green Lantern soon. Oh, he got me. Oh. Oh, that's gonna sting. Wow, that hurt. Yeah, old baseballs like it. Old faithful. So yeah, I'm hoping we get another Green Lantern movie soon, like a standalone movie. I mean, obviously they'll bring it into the DC um, cinematic universe because they seem to be copying Marvel at the moment. We're doing that. I mean, it's a good way of doing it, because obviously all the movies connect with each other. You get you get you get more attached to the characters like that. That's why Marvel are doing so good at the moment, in my opinion. Um, but I hope we get to see a Green Lantern um, movie soon. Oh, I would like to see Hal Jordan soon. Or even not Hal Jordan, maybe John Stewart. Either one, either one just having a Green Lantern back, back in the whole um, cinematic universe would be good. Using Venom is dangerous, Bane. Begin. I mean, I know that the Lantern Corps was um, hinted at in the Justice League movie because I recently just watched that and um, there are Green Lanterns in the when Diana's telling Bruce the uh, story of Stefan Wolf there is um, a lantern or a couple of lanterns in that um, flashback scene oh I didn't even realize that was going to be a transition Ouch. Get wrecked, Bane. So I kind of became more attached to the um, Green Lantern in the story of this one because in this one it's more of a story of redemption for him because in the first one he uh, bailed on the Green Lantern Corps and he joined the um, Sinestro Corps. Okay, I think it's time. I know a lot of people want to see it. I love that. Just the way how he assembles the mech and everything. Yeah. Wow, the AI fucked up there. Majorly. Ouch. I don't know the way how Bane gets like hyper armor. But I genuinely don't know the way how he gets hyper armor. I don't think he should get hyper armor. I don't. I say hyper armor. I don't know whether that's what it's actually called in this game, but I know in, in For Honor it's called hyper armor. 
Uh, when you see, um, like, in that fight you saw Bane occasionally flash, it means I can't interrupt his move with any of mine. Which is, um, it's frustrating. It's frustrating. I'm not scared. My fear toxin will fix that. Overcoming fear is kind of my thing. Begin. And the other reason I like doing this is because the AI will put random outfits on the um, characters. So you get to see what some of them would look like with their... Um, with some of the um, outfits you can get in-game for them. Ah. Yeah, catch you right out the air, bitch. Ouch. I ha I will admit I do hate hate fighting Scarecrow because his zone game is crazy. Like he has so much zone capability, it's it's annoying. Ow! I mean, the Green Lantern Zone game. Um, can be crazy good as well. The Green Lantern Zone game is it's not up to like the power of um Harley Quinn or um who else got a good zone? Uh Deadshot, Deadshot's a really good zoner. I mean it's not up to the standards of them, I mean those characters are kinda of designed to zone. But it still can be like quite good. Well, I wasted that interactable. Okay, I'm kind of glad I got my shield up there. I take it you guys can see what I mean now by the uh, shield doesn't do an awful lot. I mean, effectively, all the lantern has in his zone is um, that, this, and that. And the wall isn't really a zone unless you get them pretty close range and you can pop it and then meet a burn it. Like that. That's the only way you can really pull it off. He doesn't have much in the way of um, zoning. Green Lantern wins. I wish he did have more in the way of zoning, to be honest. Like, he used to have that exact Gatling gun. I don't know if he still has that Gatling gun because I don't know all of his moves. But I mean, if he doesn't have it anymore, that was a big part of his zone in the first game. So I mean, I actually have to stop and have a look. Um, when I'm, when I'm obviously, when I'm not recording, I'm not going to do it now, and um, see where that comes from. High poison ivy.
I love the way how he makes a comment about the fact of like they both like green and he's wearing purple right now. Ow, that hurts. Ow. That was like a root directly on my butt. Would you mind? That statue is not going to take much more. Uh, except your purple. Oh, thought she was going to show me some love, then, people. Oh, um, um, who's who's going to pay for that? It's for the cause. Sorry, guy. Oh, he was just casually just chilling there, like having this beer. Sorry, I just wanted to finish on the wall. So yeah, like I say, I don't know how long this video is going to be because, like I say, this is endless. It's a case of play until we lose. So far, we're on opponent 10. As I've just noticed, Firestorm is opponent 10. So I might, I don't know, I'm just looking at my recording timer. Because, um, I'm just looking at my recording timer because I think I might actually have to, um, like, deliberately lose or end the event because, um, I'm, I would like to leave this, uh, this fight in this series unedited if possible. So, Fish. What? Is that Black Mantis? Well, I suppose, yeah, it is kind of fitting because Black Mantis is one of the DLC characters. Which I will be getting. I haven't got any of the DLC just yet, but I will be getting DLC. He blocked it. I normally always land my super move. Ouch. Ouch. Punching a wall hurts, boy. Punching a hole hurts. Well, my green lantern is really growing in uh, level. So I think I'm going to let this video um, go to about the half an hour point. Around about there. And then if I'm still fighting, I will... Um, End the event. The cosmos are mine to balance. Fine. Winner gets jurisdiction. Begin. Uh, 
Ah, oh, Doctor Fate is annoying. It's that teleport that's, that makes him more annoying than most. Because he can literally just phase. Because I swear his like lantern blast used to be his Gatling gun. But I don't know whether him like having his Gatling gun in the end scene when he wins is like a nod to it or whether it's actually a move in the game. Yep, you can have your four bars. Because now that all that means is I have more super power than you. Which means I have more ability to do meter burns. And stuff like that. Kneel before the lantern. More gear. We're getting gear for days, people. So yeah, I think I'm actually going to um, end the event here. And what we'll do is we'll have a look at the, some of the gear we got. Just to finish off the video. Finish event. So yeah, we will finish her. I mean, like I say, we could have literally been going for hours. I'm thinking maybe endless was not the best way to do it. So we got a mother box out of it. Right. So good. All the multiverses have been renewed. Because I mean, what I was originally going to do was I was going to go. Um, is it here? No, not here. Yeah, I think it might have been here, and I was going to try. I was going to try and grind, use the video to grind out some other boxes, ready for the mother box opening um, video. But anyway, we don't have that. So uh, customized characters. I think we only got gear for lantern. Oh no, we got some gear for Captain Cole, but we're just going to have a look at the lantern gear. Oh wait, I, I went way past it. So, what do we get? Did we get anything worth keeping? That's what I want to know. So, destructive lantern vest. It doesn't look very good. Gives me a lot of strength, but it takes away health. Okay, now I like this. It looks good. Like the actual chest piece itself, it looks good. And it gives me ability, defense, and health. Which I like. Uh, transition resistance reduces damage taken from arena transitions by 2.55%. Okay, I like that. So yes, we're going to keep this. And we will um, discard the rest. What else have we got here? Oh, They give us a big ability boost. Which means the shield would be... Um, more beneficial and they don't really give us much either see I think we're gonna keep these one because it gives us more health but two because it gives us um, more ability which means our shield will actually be um, more beneficial or uh, will soak up more damage for us so legs let's start from the bottom they give us some good strength um, and health but a take away from our ability and our defense so we don't really want to minus anything unless it's worth it now these are epics and they give us they take away a bit of ability but they give us a lot of defense in um, in return they give us a 
plus 241 defense, which is good. Um, it means we're going to take less damage overall, which is also good. So our ability and our defense both at the moment are quite high, which means we're going to have um, a lot less damage being taken, which is also good. Now, no, my other lantern I own, the only other lantern I have is this one, which um, I will be putting on. I don't really like this lantern, I've got it on because it's an epic. But I will be putting that on when I next level up. So in the next video with the lantern, you may see that. So, shaders. I have on the compassion shader at the moment. But if I put on his original shader, that is how he looks. But um, I'm either holding out for the willpower shader because I feel like that looks nicer. Or one of these, the Need Metal shader, I feel like I feel like that looks really cool. Or the John Stewart skin that we have, which I think looks... It doesn't look as nice as some of the armor pieces and stuff, but the fact that John Stewart is mentioned um, in the game is really cool. In my opinion, it's really cool. So we're going to go over, we're going to save that setup and go over here, and anything that is not equipped... We are going to sell. Because we don't need gear that we're not using. Apart from that lantern, because that lantern will be going on as soon as I level them back up. Well, not back up. So we got 2,400 and something monies for that. So I will be using the uh, game currency as well to um, just see. I think it was a shader we got for Flash. Yeah, so that's that's all my shash, sh uh, sh shash Flash looks like at the moment. Again, we have Jay Garrick's Flash and Reverse Flash as skins. So, like I say, nods to um, Reverse Flash and other Flash. They couldn't really... D okay, well that's just going because we have an epic on him. Epics beat everything. That's that's my rule. Epics beat everything. Right, I like the defense, so I'm gonna get rid of them. Okay, we won't get an awful lot, no. But like I say, I will be using the um, in-game currency. So let's see how many how many mother boxes we actually have at the moment. Yeah, we have a couple, but um, I, I, I want more. And I can't buy any while I have stuff like in there. So, while I have mother boxes in there, I can't actually buy stuff. So, that is going to be the end of this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please do leave a like down below and comment your opinions and what character you would like to see me do Endless with next. I know it wasn't Endless. Um, I don't know I didn't play until I died or I'm playing until I was defeated. But, anyway, thank you guys again for watching and I will see you guys in the next video.